Well, hello internet, hello son. Uh, first off, let me get this out of the way. Congratulations, buddy. Third grade's gonna be good. Um, I just wanna, right now, it's a good day. Bought the machine at an auction, rigging, setup, electrical, all that stuff. I got one more. Uh, when it finishes this, what we're doing is I'm circle milling three quarters of an inch holes, inch and three quarters deep, rather than drill them. This is just easier with this machine. Um, this machine has just paid for itself. All the rigging, all the fees from the auction. Matter of fact, I'm $300 positive after this order right here. Uh, got an order in right there. And that means that this machine is in the money now. So, what I gotta tell you, son, is, man, that was a lot of work, but it had to be done. Sometimes you gotta do things you don't wanna do. But it needed done and I don't know what, two months, three months top, two months tops. Uh, we own it, it's ours. Basically, I, it's, it's paid for itself. It's paid for the move, it's paid for the riggers, it's paid for the electrical. Um, I'm not gonna say what I paid, but it's, it's clear. So. That's what's going on today. I'm gonna to finish that order up and let's do a walk through the shop. I'm gonna go this way. Let's just zip around. I'm cutting a bunch of, I've got to make 15 of those. So we're chopping those. Finish the job on the bridge port. Oh, I'm doing a handrail. Yes. Side mounted handrail put my hole through there uh, comes from a print just a guy I don't know here there's the sketch and I've got a gate going on and back here I don't know if you guys have seen those articulating dolls called lucky 13 this is lucky 13 and 150 percent this one here is going to be in the, the skeletons are in black and then the body armor is going to be in copper and these things make a mess i gotta get a trash can back here because they and the poop bin fills up pretty quick too but poops down here saving those for you buddy well, let's go into town. Got the AMS. I got my riser finished. Printed this in four pieces. Uh, PLA Plus is what I did. Snaps together with these little bow ties. And you can, uh, you can, if you're printing carbon fiber or whatever, uh, 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 ABS, you can close that up. And if you need some more ventilation, you can open it. So I just print it like that. I moved it back here because of all that stuff, all the poops. So I'm gonna unload this part. I have to remember to pick up my feet because I watch my vi videos and I'm, I'm dragging my feet everywhere. It's these, it's these old boots. So here we go. Nice little fine chips. I wasn't even, basically I'm running, Speeds and feeds that were running on the old mill just because I know it's good. Ow! Cut my finger. No, I'm kidding. Um, RJ, I'm really proud of you, son. You watched this video. Uh, you kicked this ball up in the, in the gym at school and it, I mean, I'm telling you, it's probably 35, 30 feet, 35 feet up in the air and it got jammed up by a, uh, one of the air conditioning ducts. And he is just distraught over it. So 
Uh, I got you covered, buddy. I'm not gonna say what happened, but I got you covered, man. Uh, we were watching those uh, YouTube videos on them, kicking those those balls that move. Anyways, I just want to tell you, if you uh, go to an auction, buy a machine, get a job for it, not so bad. Just gotta go get a good machine. Pick the right machine. Um, I guess I was pretty lucky because I knew the history of it. I mean, it's not, I don't have a fourth axis. I'm still over there on the stupid spacer, the indexer. But um, you can do it if you want to do it. It's tough. Now I just got to try to get more work for it so I can get in the, the, the everybody thinks you make big money, you know, big money. I'll tell you what, my big money makes over there on that manual stuff, it seems like. Um, I don't know, I need to get a secretary, that's what I need. I need to get a secretary to do all that, that stuff over there in that office, right there. It's really tough to do all of it. That's about it. RJ go, <laughs> hold on, let me show you this. So we've got a houseless person problem out here. And I know it's hilarious, but uh, RJ got on eBay the other day and let me show you <laughs> in his little. <laughs> uh, hold on here. All right, he got a he got a money. Let me pull it out. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that stack of money. See that? RJ got that. <laughs> that cash is fake. <laughs> he kept from eBay. But out here in the road, where all the houseless people are, if you put some of this in the road and let the cars blow it over down there, it is a hoot. <laughs> Big money. I should make it, make it, make a. It'd be like, be like, all you gotta do is buy a CNC machine, you get all this cash, all this money, you get all these if you buy me a CNC machine. Not really. <laughs> yeah, get more in the industry. That's what we need. More money, more machines. Not really. You can get some eBay money. <laughs> Get you one of them Tormachs. Get the cash. <laughs> Anyways, that's enough goofing around. Just thought I'd drop a little, uh, drop video. We're gonna go mess with some houseless people. Um, I love you, son. I'll see you later. Like, follow, subscribe. We just, uh, we just do it. That's what we do. Till next time.